The universe is a vast and mysterious place filled with countless wonders and secrets waiting to be discovered among the many mysteries of the cosmos. One of the most fascinating and profound is the age of the universe itself. If you are interested in amazing videos about the universe, be sure to subscribe to our channel to stay updated. Scientists have spent decades studying the universe using a variety of tools and techniques to unravel the mysteries of our cosmic past. Through their efforts, they have determined that the universe is estimated to be around 13.8 billion years old. The search for the age of the universe began in the early 20th century when astronomers first realized that our universe was expanding. The concept of an expanding universe was first proposed by Belgian astronomer Georges Lemaitre in 1927, but it wasn't until the work of American astronomer Edwin Hubble in the 1920s and 1930s that the idea was widely accepted. Hubble's groundbreaking observations of distant galaxies revealed that they were moving away from us at great speeds, and that the farther away a galaxy was, the faster it was moving. This relationship, known as Hubble's Law, suggested that the universe was not static, but was instead expanding. If the universe was expanding, then it must have been smaller in the past, and this realization led scientists to wonder just how old the universe was. The first attempts to estimate the age of the universe were based on models of stellar evolution. Scientists knew that stars undergo a predictable sequence of changes as they age, and they thought that by studying the properties of stars in our own galaxy, they could determine the age of the universe. However, these early estimates were plagued by uncertainties in our understanding of stellar evolution, and they varied widely from a few million years to several billion years. It wasn't until the 1960s that a more accurate method for determining the age of the universe was discovered. In 1964, two astronomers named Arno Penzias and Robert Wilson discovered a faint background radiation that was present in all directions of the sky. This radiation, known as the Cosmic Microwave Background, CMB, is thought to be the leftover radiation from the Big Bang the event that marked the birth of the universe. The discovery of the CMB was a major breakthrough in our understanding of the universe, and it provided scientists with a powerful tool for estimating the age of the universe. By studying the properties of the CMB, scientists could infer important details about the early universe, such as its temperature and composition. This information, in turn, could be used to estimate the age of the universe over the next few decades. Scientists refined their measurements of the CMB and improved their understanding of the early universe. They also developed more sophisticated models of cosmic evolution, which took into account the effects of dark matter and dark energy, two mysterious substances that make up the majority of the universe. By combining these observations and models, scientists arrived at an estimate for the age of the universe, 13.8 billion years. This estimate has been confirmed by a variety of independent measurements, including observations of distant supernova and the large-scale structure of the universe. The age of the universe is one of the most well-established facts in cosmology, and it has profound implications for our understanding of the cosmos. The age of the universe tells us that our universe has a long and fascinating history, stretching back billions of years to a time when the universe was just a tiny, hot, and dense singularity. It tells us that the stars and galaxies we see today are the result of billions of years of cosmic evolution driven by the forces of gravity and the interplay between matter and energy. Why is it still expanding at an accelerating rate? What is the nature of dark matter and dark energy? And how do they shake the evolution of the universe? How did the first stars and galaxies form? And what was the nature of the universe in its earliest moments? These are just a few of the many questions that cosmologists are working to answer. The age of the universe provides a crucial piece of information in the quest to understand the cosmos, but it is just one piece of a much larger puzzle. One of the most fascinating aspects of the age of the universe 
is how it connects to the fundamental nature of space and time. According to Einstein's theory of general relativity, space and time are intertwined, forming a four-dimensional fabric known as space-time. This fabric can be warped and distorted by the presence of matter and energy, leading to phenomena like gravitational waves and black holes. The age of the universe tells us that space-time has been evolving for billions of years, stretching and warping in response to the forces of the cosmos. It tells us that the very fabric of the universe has a history, and that the structures we see today are the result of an intricate interplay between space-time, matter, and energy. While the universe is expanding at an accelerating rate today, it is still unclear what the ultimate fate of the universe will be. Some theories suggest that the universe will continue to expand forever, eventually becoming a cold and dark place devoid of stars and galaxies. Other theories suggest that the universe will eventually collapse in on itself, leading to another Big Bang and the birth of a new universe. Whatever the ultimate fate of the universe may be, the age of the universe tells us that we are living in a remarkable moment in cosmic history. We have the opportunity to study the universe at a time when it is still evolving and changing, when stars are still being born and galaxies are still colliding and merging. By studying the universe and its evolution, we can gain insights into the fundamental nature of the cosmos and our place within it. The age of the universe also provides us with insights into the likelihood of intelligent civilizations existing elsewhere in the cosmos. If life is a relatively common occurrence in the universe, and if the conditions for the development of intelligent life are present on other planets, then there may be many civilizations out there that are much older and more advanced than our own. Moreover, the age of the universe has implications for our search for extraterrestrial life. By studying the conditions that led to the emergence of life on Earth, and by exploring the diversity of life forms on our planet, we can gain insights into the types of environments and conditions that might be conducive to the emergence of life elsewhere in the universe. Some theories suggest that the universe is just one of many in a multiverse, a vast and complex network of parallel universes with their own unique properties and histories. The age of the universe tells us that if a multiverse does exist, then there has been ample time for the emergence of many different universes, each with its own unique history and destiny. Finally, the age of the universe reminds us of the incredible beauty and wonder of the cosmos. From the cosmic microwave background radiation left over from the Big Bang to the intricate dance of stars and galaxies across the night sky, the universe is a rich and complex tapestry of phenomena that is both awe-inspiring and humbling. In conclusion, the age of the universe is a remarkable fact that has profound implications for our understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. It tells us about the origins and evolution of the universe, the potential for extraterrestrial life, the nature of reality itself, and the beauty and wonder of the cosmos. As we continue to explore the mysteries of the universe, the age of the universe will remain a key piece of information guiding us in our quest to understand the cosmos and our place within it.